stronger slough force means you can move more material quickly back into the trench. It can also deliver the power you need to slough the excavator when working on a slope. Bobcat excavators have much more slough force and this test proves it. Up to 46% more than deer. The others also fell short of the numbers put up by both Bobcat excavators. We put each machine under a load cell test that is accurate and repeatable. We secured the load cell between a floor anchor and the arm at an identical position on each excavator. We measured the peak slew force to see which machine has the most. The Bobcat E35 with 33 horsepower set the standard with a peak force of 735 pounds. The Bobcat E35 with 25 horsepower was close behind with a peak force of 695 pounds. The Caterpillar came in with a peak force of 541 pounds. So the Bobcat E35 with 25 horsepower is 29% more powerful. And the E35 with 33 horsepower is 36% more powerful than Caterpillar. The Kubota machine put up a peak force of 561 pounds, which means the Bobcat E35 with 25 horsepower is 24% more powerful than Kubota. And the Bobcat E35 with 33 horsepower is 31% more powerful. The deer fared the worst by putting up 504 pounds of force, making the Bobcat E35 with 25 horsepower 38% more powerful. And the E35 with 33 horsepower is 46% more powerful than the deer. The numbers tell the story and the Bobcat excavators have more slew force than the others. Stronger slew force gives you more power to move more material quickly and be more productive.